stars as Outlander is loved for many reasons and powerful sex scenes are one, however, season 4 had fewer intimate scenes but that's justified, if not anything else. The tenure of Droughtlander, gives us enough time to reflect and ponder about the bygone seasons while looking forward to the upcoming ones. Weeks down the line after season 4 wrapped with an explosive finale, fans reminisce an integral Outlander characteristic that was largely absent in the latest season Jamie, Sam Hewen, and Claire Fraser's, Katrina Balfe, sex scenes. There are ample reasons why Outlander is one of the favorite shows and there's something for everyone, a time to find love, time travel, adventurous journeys, supernatural elements, outstanding costumes family dynamics and many other things, but it's also the meaningful and intimate sex scenes that the show portrays that stands out the most, mainly because it is so empowering and well-crafted that fans have identified it to be a representation of powerful love bearing a strong feminist message. Four seasons and then that point still stands true as it was when season one aired. Recalling the Jamie and Claire sex scene in season four, the first one stands out the one that takes place in a forest. Claire climbs into Jamie's lap and runs his hand down her skin as she arches her back in ecstasy. Following this, we hardly got any major unforgettable sex scenes throughout the season, except the one with Brianna Fraser and Roger McKenzie after their hand-fest ceremony in the 18th century Wilmington. That sex, which was Brianna losing virginity lasted for hours, and it was intense and had its own charm. But it was Claire and Jamie's sex scene which was thoroughly missed by the fans. It was also questioned if Outlander was the groundbreaking show as it used to be. An article on the fan site puts it in perspective, the show is brimming with adventures, cliffhangers, great characters and performances, social commentary, and lots of sentimentality. It has lost touch, however, with the thrust and depth, puns intended, of the writings of Diana Gabaldon who shows us a relationship like nothing we have seen before on television, an egalitarian relationship where the joy, intensity, fun, playfulness, and excitement of being a couple never stops for Claire and Jamie, despite the passing of years and all the dramas that develop and revolve around them. Many fans agreed with the author and even added that they missed the love story the first fell in love with. In a recent interview, this point was discussed and co-executive producer Meryl Davis justified that every season is different. This season we were introducing more characters, and there was a lot of story to get in. We've always talked about the sex scenes, we love them too, but they have to be organic to the story. Season 4 mostly focused on Brianna and Roger, their separation and tough love. Jamie and Claire played the backdrop parents trying to bring back Roger to Brianna at least in the later episodes. For the first half, the time the Frasers was all about finding a home and building one. Sex scenes were, um, forgettable. But that's just one season, and we can't be harsh on all the steamy moments the show gave. Added to that, season 5 is coming, not soon, but still is on its way. I do anticipate a return, hopefully, to that next season a little more, Davis shared. She is a major fan of Diana Gabaldon's Outlander series so she knows that lack of sex scenes may not have pleased the fans. This is the fifth season, and we're trying to find those intimate moments without always having to show everything and putting actors in that position. But I get it. I want everyone to be satisfied, she concluded adding the heart and soul of the story is Claire and Jamie, we never forget that.